Now, learning at Kolanya Boys High School in Teso North, Busia County, has suffered a major setback after 52 students, six teachers, and two staff tested positive for coronavirus. Busia Governor Sospita Ojamong says they have since ordered the students to self-isolate within the school premises and shut movement in and out of the school to contain the spread of the virus. This comes just a day before education stakeholders are set to meet with the president over a plan to fully reopen learning institutions. Caroline Kamau starts off tonight's coverage with that update. Learning at Kolanya Boys High School in Busia County has temporarily been interrupted after the school reported at least 60 people had tested positive for the coronavirus. Busia Governor Suspita Ojamong says those who tested positive for the virus have been isolated while the rest of the students, teachers and non-teaching staff have been quarantined as a safety measure. A random test was carried out at Kolanya High School. It was shocking to learn that out of the 100 tests carried out, Six cases tested positive for COVID-19. Busia County Commissioner Joseph Kanyiri urged parents not to panic as they contain the situation. Kakati imewekwa kushugurikia haya mambo. Tayari kuna vifa ambavo vimetumano na robi na zinafika hileo ambapo tafanya testing zaidi kujua hari kamiri katika ile shule yetu. Hamuna haja wazazi kuanza kukimbia kule shule na kusema ah tupereke watoto nyumbani. Kwa kufanya hivyo ni kusambaza mambukizi kwa jamii na kwa familia. Busia County has reported a total of 1,683 positive cases out of 75,564 tests. At the same time, Kilifi County Assembly has been closed for two weeks after one of the staff tested positive for COVID-19. County Assembly Speaker Jimmy Kahende said the move was a precautionary measure to prevent further exposure to the disease after it emerged that the affected employee mingled with colleagues during the burial of a staff member last weekend. Uh, even though members were on recess, um, but uh, the County Assembly Service Board was uh, actively here and conducting its duties. And uh, of course, the members of staff were here as well. For that reason, therefore, we have uh, closed the assembly for the next 14 days. And uh, we have advised the members of staff to go into self-quarantine. And uh, where possible, they must also carry out tests, which are freely done at our general hospital in Malindi. And police in Kakamega arrested 27 people in Mumias for failing to wear masks as per the government's directive to contain the spread of coronavirus. During the crackdown, some of the residents also demanded the officers wear masks before taking them into custody. Maskari shida yao ni moja. Ni wazuri lakini kuna shida moja wako naye. Kama unaweza kuja unishike mimi kwa sababu sina mask na wewe mwenyewe unakuja kushika mimi kwa mlango wa nyumba yangu na una hata mask wewe mwenyewe. Sasa una expect mimi ni wewe mimi nikiwa kama sina mask na wewe una mask umeniweka gari na watu tume tumejaa kwa gari. Others expressing mixed reactions on the crackdown. Mumia's West Sub County Commissioner Charles Wambogo warned they will not relent in enforcing the Ministry of Health guidelines on COVID 19, adding residents to wear face masks, ensure social distancing, and wash their hands. Corona is real, and we better start taking care of ourselves because if you want to die, unfortunately, you are going to die together with your loved ones. And, uh, the, the, the issue and perception of, of people saying that uh, uh, the government uh, must come and enforce for them, I think uh, that should not be the case. Caroline Kamar reporting for Channel 1 News.